Governor Whitmer has said from the onset of this pandemic, she will follow the advice of the experts. Tonight, one of the nation's top experts is saying it is time for Michigan to shut it down. CDC Director Dr. Rochelle Walensky didn't mince words, warning that relying on vaccines alone is not enough to stop this surge. We know that if vaccines go in arms today, we will not see an effect of those vaccines, depending on the vaccine, for somewhere between two to six weeks. The CDC director says given the extraordinary number of cases in Michigan right now, we need more immediate action. The answer to that is to really close things down, to go back to our basics, to go back to where we were last spring, um, last summer, and to, to shut things down, to flatten the curve, to decrease contact with one another, to test to the extent that we have available to, to contact trace. Sometimes you can't even do it at the capacity that you need, but really what we need to do in those situations is shut things down. Michigan will not receive more vaccine doses, but the federal government is sending monoclonal antibody treatments, more tests, a CDC response team, and 140 FEMA vaccinators. In the next two to six weeks, uh, the variants that we've seen in, in uh, Michigan, those variants are also present in, uh, present in other states. So our ability to vaccinate people quickly in all of each of those states, rather than taking vaccines and shifting it uh, to playing whack-a-mole, um, isn't the strategy that um, public health leaders and scientists have, have laid out. We need that vaccine in other places. If we vaccinate today, um, we will have you know impact in six weeks, and we don't know where the next place is, is going to be that is going to surge. Another public health expert put it like this. When you have a house fire, you don't just focus all of your water on the blaze. You need to spray water on the houses next door, too, to prevent the fire from spreading.